Hello, and welcome to the National Partnership for Juvenile Services eLearning Center. The courses in the center have been designed for new juvenile justice staff by experienced juvenile justice staff. They contain interactive activities and are best done with the support of a mentor or coach from your program who can provide local policies and answer any questions participants may have during or after the course. The Juvenile Rights eLearning course begins with a brief quiz to determine participants' familiarity with the basic rights protected by the U.S. Constitution and how incarceration may impact those rights. The course reviews the application of constitutional amendments that protect rights such as freedom of religion and freedom from cruel and unusual punishment and describes court cases that have set precedents for correctional situations. It addresses other sources of rules that apply to youth in custody, such as federal and state laws, including the Individuals with Disabilities Education Act, or IDEA. Another section addresses youth rights regarding contact with the community through telephone, mail, and family visits, and explains when the agency may have some discretion in protecting or limiting those rights. A final section discuss, discusses grievance procedures and a, that allow youth to register protests regarding their treatment and how those grievances must be dealt with. During the course review, there's a brief discussion of staff rights that I think your participants will be very interested in. An e-learning course like this one is best when reinforced by an exter experienced staff member or supervisor from your program who can share local information and answer the specific questions. For more information about this and other programs, please contact the National Partnership for Juvenile Services. We hope you enjoy this program.